back. Well, there are some awesome tools in our community to help kids prepare for heading back to school, including the specificity of, you know, getting their health in line. In DeSoto Parish coming up, Community Health Ways will host an indoor health and resource fair. And join with me today are two of their beautiful representatives from Region 7. We have Miss Tanil Jenkins, who is the supervisor. And over here we have Maria Bourgeois. Now, you guys were just explaining to me that Region 7 doesn't just um, cover DeSoto Parish. You guys have multiple parishes under your belt. Talk about that. Right. Um, we take care of all of Region 7. There's four of us um, here in this area. So we each take care of certain parishes. And uh, Maria has um, Caddo and DeSoto Parish. So okay. she's taking the lead on this event. Okay, sounds good. Now with this, you know, event that you're bringing to, you know, DeSoto Parish, talk to us about what we can expect and, you know, the importance of it and getting these students prepared to go back to school healthy. Okay. <laughs> um, well, the event is um, really to um, bring the whole community together. Um, we're going to have some health um, fairs. Um, with that health fair, it's going to be bringing um, the A1C count. We're doing blood pressure. We're doing um, we're doing a lot of fun, free activities for the kids. We have the 4-H with um, the LSU Ag Center mm -hmm. coming out, and they're going to do some activities with the kids. We're going to do. Um, back to school um, stuff for the um, younger kids. We're gonna do older, you know, gifts as well for the older population. Okay, sounds good. Now, how can everyone participate in this? Um, with this event, do they have to register or whatnot? I heard the word free. It's free. So it's free, so it's how do they participate? Um, it's absolutely free. They just show up and just come on in. And we have the fire department there. We have a fleet uh, blood drive that we're doing actually as well. So, I mean, we have a lot of activities. We have over 50 vendors that's going to be there. We're pulling people from the VA hospital as well. But we're trying to touch bases with everybody to give everybody opportunity to get those resources and, and kind of um, feel like they have that support in the community. Okay. And when and where is this all taking place? It's going to be at the LSU Ag Center in Grand Cane. Okay, at what time does everything kick off? Do we need to pull up and, you know, make sure that we're there on time? <laughs> it's going to be at 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock to 2 o'clock. Okay, sounds good, you guys. So mark your calendar for this Thursday, August 1st, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. They will be there having all the resources that you need, so you definitely do not want to miss out. We'll be right back.